Hello everybody, Jet here, and welcome back to my Krokgar playthrough here in Total War Warhammer 3, the Thrones of Decay, where I'm going over everybody else's territory for some reason, where if you remember from last time, we've just dealt with the Dowie threat, we are consolidating, we are pushing the Trickster out of his last stronghold in the jungles, I know he's got one up here in the desert, which we will deal with. And then we are going to launch an invasion down here to try and clear him out of the southern wastes as early as possible. Which we'll, we'll, we'll have to see how that goes because I've... Um, well, well, yeah, we'll, we'll just have to see how that goes because I've got a feeling it won't go well. But you never know. Ooh, I'm going to grab this building. While I can't, I prefer it here, but should I just get rid of this? I'm gonna get rid of that to get rid get some other build some extra buildings. Oh hang on, what level is it? Ah I am clearing away some monetary buildings to get some other buildings so I can actually recruit everything here. I know I'm cutting my income a bit, but I need I want a proper recruitment hub if you see what I mean. More diamonds, please. Let's repair here. I'll do for now. I am building another army, which is going to cost me a lot. Oh, no. How the hell did he get there? That is a little concerning. Um, but he's there. But... No, I, I really need to deal with them because they are being very, very problematic for me, so. Darkness. There we go. More growth, please. Let's get here settled as well. Shoot down here. That one. Okay, I did not realize it needed to be higher level, but we'll also start getting that one too. There we go, that's better. Uh, proud warrior. Lots more comets, of course. All of growth, get our repairs going. There you go, my kingdom down here in in southern, in the southern lust, not southern lustria, the south, southern jungles, uh, southern land. I, I, I always forget what the tip here is called, because this is the Southlands. I think it is still part of the Southlands. You know, we aren't doing. Oh, why? Why would you go to war with the Lawmasters? Let us move here. We are going to prep for a large scale invasion down here. How many settlements do they actually have? How the hell does he have 16 settlements? You cannot deceive. Okay, we're going to wait a turn to get a bit more replenishment. Let's 
slowly rebuilding, getting ourselves ready. I said, dealing with Zichi Boy down there is gonna be um fun. Is fun the right word? Hold to the vision. Yes, please. It is time. Bit more moolah. Nice. So we are nearly max level with the boss man. Have I mentioned that I disliked Zeech? Right now we are being fairly chilled in everything we do, but, well, I say I'm being fairly chilled. I am going to invade Seach's heartland quite aggressively. I'm not going to hold anything there. I'm just going to burn it all down. I would love the um, pointy ears to have still had a settlement there, but they, they got rid of it. I should really see if I can confederate anybody, because I might be able to confederate these guys now, because I'm much more powerful than them. And they do have some good territory. Good. It looks like the hu I, I mean, I shouldn't say good. It looks like the uh, Valky has reset or set up, so. Why not? Why do you not love me? Annoy me. Straight for his goddamn capital. Okay, building up the geomantic web nicely as well. Creating a nice strong lizard man, lizard man nation down here with lots of uh, with a strong geomantic web to add to our protection and our prosperity and our growth and all the good stuff. I really should I have just realized several of my places are at max level and I probably got them left on growth at the moment. We'll see how it goes. So just... No. It's beginning to annoy me. Deal with him. Don't deal with him. For you, the dark talk. 
I want to make sure we make landfall together. There ain't no frog here. Don't know what they're talking about. No frogs here. Soon, I'll get that army moved back up. I might turn him around and start trying to batter their agents here. I'm a little concerned about the Skaven. I'm not that concerned about their army. It's just annoying. I should, I should probably stop trying to chase it now. Teleporting away. I wish you could intercept teleports. It's time. It's time. Zardok, talk. Oh. I thought we'd be able to stay close to each other. Oh, and you see, now he runs away. Of course he does. Ah, you see, the growth one does also give income. That, however... Global recruitment capacity... Yeah. Eh. The research rate, however... I said that, how much income? No! I'm gonna stay on the income, because, you know, it's a big chunk of extra income we're getting from our nice, powerful geomantic web. Flock of Doom is a spectacularly fun spell, but they really need to up its... They need to up its vigils, because so many of the other spells look so good now compared to Flock of Doom, and I think they could make Flock of Doom look so much better. Even if it's just a big crow flying above its head, the, the area. Um... Compared to the other spells, it just doesn't look anywhere near as visually spectacular. I'm assuming it's probably going to get a tweak at some point, because everything seems to be. That us kind of huddle together. God damn them. I'm going to have a turn to replenishment before I do anything, but I'm going to go and try and burn here to the ground. Right. So, four units of horned ones I want. I can't afford four units. Boo! And I want to get an engine, a solar engine. And you could get an Arcosotac. It is fairly solid. Oh, it does not affect friendly troops. I want an arc of Zotac. I need an altar of Zotac.
would removing this be a very silly idea? I've got this elsewhere, don't I? Goodbye, Slan building. I know, but I can easily build one elsewhere. I hadn't realised the altar of the Ark of Sotek was a vortex, so we'll, we'll, we'll try and get that. Yes, I know I'm a noob, guys. Obviously, we probably won't get into this army quite uh, straight away, but we'll see. We'll see. Bugger? Heavy Metal Toad is being ambushed by the forces of Tseech. I completely... F I always forget Tseech has this option. I mean, we're not in bad state. We're not in the best state, but we're not in the worst state. But this is a big army. There is... Every possibility that the heavy metal toad may fall. We may have to christen a new heavy metal toad. That said, this is a, 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 a solid army. Oh god, they're getting reinforcements as well. Why did I go so close to the settlement? I am an Egypt. No escape route either. You guys. Hit that cockatrice. I mean, these guys are solid in their own right, so... Let us fire some magic. So you can kind of see what I'm doing here. I'm trying to create a protective barrier for my guys. As we try and close things down. I want you guys to actually break off from there and attack here. I want you guys to try and break through and charge that. In we go to support here. Charge. You can actually come around this way to try and flank. Good. We've closed that unit down. This isn't necessarily about winning at this point. It's about causing as much damage to the enemy as possible. Try and bring these guys right around the back here. My ancient Stegodons are doing their duty nicely there. Hit 
that, please. Good. Shit. Reform. Pull these guys back. Charge this way, good. We're breaking a lot of them. Reform, just charge, just charge. Charge that unit. Damn it. Oh no, no, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. You can push this way. Right. Burn that, please. You guys, I want out here as fast as possible to try and close things down. Good. At least we hit. It wasn't the best hit, but it was a hit. Try and charge forwards. I need to close things down. Uh, too much ranged. Keep on charging. Doggies onto here. That did sod all. Right, you can actually charge back into here, please. They should be able to take that. Should and can are a different are different things, but charge. Okay, we forced them to engage in melee there. That is one of the key things for us to try and do, is to get them engaging in melee, because when they're engaging in melee... They're less scary. Don't get me wrong, they're still scary. They're just less scary. Oh, I mean, I've made them pay for this. Even if the heavy metal toad dies, they have paid a heavy price for this. It almost looked like he shot lightning as he hit it. Come on, my beautiful Stegadons! Why, why did I accidentally make them? Why did I make them rampage? That was silly of me. Sorry, I was just intrigued by what the ability did. Lightning right on myself! Come on, you're all wearing metal! Burn! Come on, my Stegadons! It's our soul. 
We might actually survive. Charge. Oh my god. How? I, I do not know how I survived that. Uh, we lost some of my my my, my, my stegodons closed down their ranged, and that is what ancient stegodons are good for. Like right? they can do ranged, but they are even when they are in melee, the guys on their back are continuously pinging away. So they they did the job. They may have died doing the job, but they did it. And Sabaton, the toad, did survive. However, this has probably put quite a big dent on our invasion. Well, I say that. This is, means we're going to be using a lot more um, re re uh, regiments of renown down here. Mm, didn't lose quite as much as I thought I feared. Note how they went to them rather than Croc Gar. Finish it. I do not want him involved at all. We are actually going to take here though, so I can set that army in there. Interesting. Hey, it's still rubbish territory for us, but that's not the worst thing in the world. Nicely. And that, with us having a foothold down here in the southern waste, having taken his capital, I think is a good place for us to leave it for today. So thank you very much for watching. Please do like and subscribe if you are enjoying this playthrough. Uh, pop a comment in down below let me know what you think and as always an extra special thank you to our channel members and patrons that is monster bound nose nose andrew t putaru gavin jason air noob and kenobi scrin jared horn space ace 475 and good sir twisted and thank you everyone for watching cheers all